can you talk about the tools that Dixon is using to help measure feedback from your residents and businesses during this public health emergency? Yeah, you know, the, the tools that we're doing that with are the social media and are our human aspect. I mean, we always, customer service has always been a number one goal, connecting, going the extra mile. Um, but if there was like 1% better we could do, we're doing it, right? Um, and so I think, I think what we're seeing when we look at our engagement is the amount of people actually engaging where we're engaging them at. We're meeting people where they're at. You know, I was at an economic development summit last year and they said, I mean, whether we like it or not as government, there's not going to be a different expectation between what a person, a citizen expects out of a private company and what they expect out of their local government, right? And so that being said, it's really about that connection, that interaction, telling our story, the brand, the way that builds trust. And so our, our huge component in measurement is how many people are showing up to council meetings now on Zoom? How many people are commenting? How many people are watching? How many people are seeing and interacting with our posts? How many people, when we put something out, um, call and ask a question and get clarification? How quickly are we able to respond to be able to get back to somebody on the phone or, or via Zoom? You know, and then and then I think the biggest the biggest factor to measure our effectiveness in our engagement is the very high levels of compliance, kind of in a region where compliance is low. And when you look at all things being even, there's one difference, and that's the leadership, the proactive communication, right? The information sharing that's been happening. That is super. I'm just writing this down. Um, thank you.